Mansard Insurance PLC, one of the players in Nigeria's insurance industry, held its 22nd AGM here in Lagos. With the payment of four Kobo dividend for the end of the financial year, added with the mid-2013 payment of the interim dividend, it was an opportunity for the shareholders to express the views, raise questions, and also make recommendations. Four Kobo dividend, adding to it the interim of four Kobo, which totaled eight Kobo. But however, Mr. Chairman, this is a far cry from what, from what we are used to. We expect better dividend next time, Mr. Chairman. My Chairman, I have a few observations. First, from Earth Insurance, we want to know how far we go about that. And good. An AWR donation is good, and we will continue paying for you. And we are looking at the audit committee at page 23. I think the uh, five number of people there, we are supposed to be equal with shareholder and the board. We need a little explanation. In response to the questions raised by the shareholders, their reactions and recommendations, the CEO of the company, Mrs. Yetunde Ilori, made reference to key issues like the no premium, no cover policy, the issues concerning the insurance sector, and also the plans for debt recovery in the company. That this year, the receivable premium has gone down significantly by 92%. However, on the other hand, because it's just taken off, the immediate effect is that it has slowed down our growth because our insuring public that either two are used to taking up insurance cover and paying up subsequently and now expected to pay immediately before we accept cover. What that has done to many of them is that they have prorated their covers. So instead of taking cover for the entire year, some of them just come to us on monthly basis or quarterly basis and this has slowed down significantly our own growth. While some people, because of their own cash flow, they have decided not to insure. This is risky, but we expect that with time, things will change and uh, will benefit more from this. In respect of provision for debt, the effort that we are making to recover, we have a unit within the organization that is dedicated to uh, uh, credit re uh, debt recovery and they go out, we consult the people that owe us, we ensure that we collect this. And where necessary, we have not shied away from even engaging the services of external debt collectors to go after them to recover. So you can be so sure we get that. Now, even with the wide ranging reforms in the Nigerian insurance sector, Manshad has posted a 2.1 billion 2013 profit. Uh, what does that mean to your group and company? Well, you know, we've come a long way, you know, and that shows the growth that we are in achieving and the trajectory that we are embarking on. It's just the beginning of the game, the beginning of the story. So we look forward to even more, you know, performance coming coming years. And we see that even with the no uh, premium, no cover policy from the uh, insurance regulators, uh, this is really now giving new levels to the Financial insurance sector, what should be done more to improve coverage, especially for those that are ready to enable this sector, like Mansard? I think no premium, no cover, no premium, no cover has just put a, a brand new structure in place. You know, that means you, you are very deliberate when you take insurance and you got to pay for the premium. And that itself has reduced one of the flaws in the insurance company, which is a, a huge uh, receivables that's in the industry. And, and he, in, at the same time, makes sure that all the relationship you have between brokers, you know, the insured, the uh, underwriters, are you know really firm. So the no 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 cover, I mean no 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 premium no cover is really putting a new life into insurance industry, and we're all looking forward to making sure that works for all of us. And on the issue of the payment of dividend, you paid interim mid-year, that's last year, uh, four Kobo. You paid again four Kobo for the end of the financial year. It's not been really an easy period for the financial industry in Nigeria. How do you feel, and even for the reactions of the shareholders, what's your take home? Well, 
that says one thing. We are consistent at the Northern Star. You know, we promise shareholders they will always get dividend twice a year. This is the worst they could get. They can only get better. And I think we are doing very well in the industry, even when you compare with other financial industries like banks and the rest. So to me, it's a, it's a good sign of the kind of commitment we have to our shareholders.